this brings up two good points. So the, the, the first point is, are we going to get there? The answer is yes. The second question is, or the question that comes out of that point is, what do we do once we get there, right? So let's, start, let's answer the first question, which, which is, are we ever actually going to get there? Are we actually going to have a complete uh, flow loop from sales order all the way down to manufacturing order, all the way back up into an algorithm to, to, to use that returned information to then better schedule the next sales order? Are we ever actually going to get there? The answer is yes. And the way we're going to get there is we're going to build it from scratch. You're going to, what's going to happen is a, 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 an organization is a brand new manufacturing organization is going to be created as a subsidiary of an existing organization. And that, and that, that brand new organization is not going to have any processes in place. They won't have, they will not have selected an ERP system yet. They will have not selected manufacturing hardware out on the edge. And so what's going to happen is over time, over the next three or four years, the, the decision makers, the presidents, the CEOs, the COOs, the CTOs are going to start talking to people like Intelli Integration before they ever move into this venture. And we're going to be a part, we're going to be with them right along, right alongside them to help architect the solution to say, if you want the holy grail, we can help you. And we can do it cost effectively. I mean, for a fraction of what you think it will cost, we can, we can implement a full scale digital factory. And the reality is, we're talking about doing this right now with a company in Ohio. Okay, there's a, new, there's a brand new company in Ohio that is essentially a joint venture between two existing companies. And they've created this new organization, this global organization that's got three manufacturing facilities. They, it's eight or nine companies altogether. They got a services group. They have, they have not selected their ERP system yet. The, the facility is still being built in Ohio. So we, they brought us in early enough. And here's why. You want to know why they brought us in early enough? Because the plant manager of the facility in Ohio has been a believer in ignition since 2010. And she said, if I could get ignition into a brand new facility, I could create a state-of-the-art digital factory. She, and she said that about ignition. Okay? And, and, when, and when she made that decision, when, when she joined this venture, when they hired her to help build this plant, she said, I need to know which integrator to talk to in order to help me do, execute my vision. So the, the point is, it's going to happen and we're going to do it. 